To serve the royal family is to serve the country. The Tojo line has long been providing the royal family with the finest of servants ever since the founding of the kingdom. The current head of servants, however, took a step further in following the family's motto, becoming not just a simple maid, but the head of royal guards as well as the strongest paladin the nation has to offer. The figure of Kirumi Tojo has been sang in countless ballads, listing her endless feats for the greater good and the safety of the innocents. I can't believe I'm meeting a legend! And I'm not risking any blood loss this time. And that's when Shabashira lost consciousness because of blood loss. No! The best way to lie is to partially tell the truth. We just need to adjust the last part of your story. <laughs> if it wasn't for her, I wouldn't have the time to finish my spell. It's because I didn't panic and have cold blood that her sacrifice wasn't for nothing. Her story matches Saihara's as expected, but... I see. Without a necromancer nearby, undeads have limited lifespans. The safest way to fight them without a holy weapon is to incapacitate them and let them disappear. Or, to be more specific, that's what you want me to believe. Uh, uh, no need to worry. I know you have no idea of where he went after he helped you, so I won't ask. He's not a fool, after all. Saihara might have instructed you, but you aren't exactly skilled liars. Your reaction just now proved it. I already know Saihar has been in contact with the fugitive. I merely wanted to see if my hunch was correct. Now that I know Ryomo was indeed in that forest, I have a lead. Our conversation is over now. I don't have any more inquiries regarding that night for you. Ah, I almost forgot. Shabashira, may I have one last word with you? In private? <laughs>